Excuse me, excuse me, have you seen this girl? Have you seen this girl? Excuse me, mate, have you seen this girl? Sorry? Have you seen this girl? No, I haven't seen this girl. No, no, no. You're a disgrace. Garlic again? Have you no shame? Stand still. I've seen her. She's here. I know it. I told you, she looks nothing like Annie. This isn't about Annie. Look, you're not thinking straight. You promised me you'd go and see that grief counsellor. It isn't about that, Penny. Why won't you listen? Come home. I'll listen to your promise. I've got to do this. Leave me. I've got to go. Oh, get back here. You are my sweet, my sweet come down. You are the most beautiful girl in this town. La da, la da de, la da, la da da he. Frankie. Hey. Here you go. Oh, thanks, sweetheart. Lovely. What can I play for you tonight? Oh, it's okay. I have to get back home. I need some quiet. Okay. Rodney. Uh, see you, Frankie. Okay. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Have you seen a man with a red shirt, beard and backpack go by? I said, excuse me, have you seen a man with a red shirt, beard and backpack go by? Do I look like an information desk to you, lady? Have you seen a man with a red shirt, beard and backpack go by? No.
Hey buddy, somebody's gonna come find you buddy, don't worry, I love you so much. Rodney! Vampire! Show me your true face! Please. Say change, damn you! Why, why won't you change? Annie! What did you say? the things you make me do. Running all over town after you. Crawling through garbage, yes. If I had it known all those years ago, I would have married Bernard from the Yacht Club. All my friends married doctors and lawyers, and I get Forrest Gump. Why won't you listen to me, Penny? Cause you're an idiot, Rodney. It's bad, I'm gonna need stitches. Well, you're just gonna sit there like a stunned mullet. <laughs> I'm bleeding, Rodney. A penny, penny. What? Penny. What? You on? What are you on about? Penny. 